everybody so i am back again with the new planner that i had shared with you um yesterday just wanted to show you how it came out um i changed out the dividers and made some new ones and what else did i do oh i used a pack of almost the whole thing of the stickers which is from joanne's um this one was called phrase sorry the neighbors phrase number nine and it was all about like girl power and girl boss so you can see the only three that i didn't use i used everything in here i love these like clear transparent stickers and then oh my gosh <laughs> um yeah i should i'll show you this one i used this vinyl it comes rolled up like this um i think it had plastic over this but i had gotten this at Tuesday morning um, I don't remember how much it cost but I knew I wanted it because it's such a pretty color the color is pink purple holographic and it is from American Crafts so I used it to make my tabs um, I did foil the tab uh, what is it called labels with oops uh, I guess it's just holographic but I went back to these Dollar Tree labels just to see if, you know, because it does say laser and inkjet, just to see if it did work with my laser. It did. Um, and it did foil fine. So it's just that this is really thin. So I had to do it twice because the first one I cut all the way through and it's hard to peel off the sticker um, off. So it is foiled. So I just, you know, did the same dividers except I added one and you know I had just foiled it um so let me just show you I took out the old dividers which had pockets so it made it a lot thinner but I'm still gonna have to add um well I may or may not have to add a pocket in here or so but um <clears throat> so first off I did a couple of initials just to use up like this side of the foil because I had designed some tab strips I don't know what they're called to just add into things but I took it a little further and decided just to laminate just these without any paper to get a transparent divider but um, I got a lot of bubbling so I have to work with that and see but I've kind of disguised it all and they worked out fine as you can see my my dividers this one's being covered by the pen but they're so pretty they're much smaller than i had before because <laughs> if you remember i had these giant things that were sticking out you know I'm, I'm still always trying out new things and working out all the kinks and everything so <clears throat> anyway so i did use up a bit of the um what's it called the, the vinyl and i just did some initials I did two of the same one. So one is over here. The other one, I don't remember where it's at, but you'll see it soon. And then the stickers, I just placed everywhere. Like the Girl Power one, I put here. And there's Sparkle up here to go with the shaker. I put, okay, so here's the first one. And you can see right here, it's got a lot of bubbling. I What I did was I adhered this down to my laminate. You know, you open up the sheet and you put your stuff in there. Then you close it and th throw it through your machine. But for some reason, I was just getting these, like, all over in the area that doesn't have anything in this bubbling effect. And even if I tried putting it back in, it wasn't going away. But I didn't want to waste this vinyl. So I just went with it. <clears throat> and it's not that noticeable, as you can see. Um... But then, you know, if I put my hand there, you'll see it. But that's okay. We're going to try out something different. It could be because my laminate was hanging down, not straight as it was being pulled in. I don't know. We'll see. But if you have any issues with that, let me know and see, you know, what is the solution. Um, do I have to set my mink higher because it was at three, which is recommended for this, I think. I don't know. So, um, oh, and I do want to thank those who are leaving comments and, you know, giving me some tips um, 
for my sewing machine I'll try and see you know about the needle size and everything anyway so here's another sticker and another sticker that says fearless and I actually I, I left it so that I could see the back card here which says blaze your own trail and I didn't do nothing to that so that this section here is my notes section so I split the notes section in two and right now they're just blank sheets for my notes oh and I, I went ahead and peeled off and stuck down my little um, like sticky note things that I have it's in the shop the next section that I had added in here is called planner stuff and these are where I keep all my measurements um, even shipping like for the shop because you know I do sell planners and all my little notes that I use for when I'm making planners so here is one divider called planner stuff and I put this sticker here and I added the little flower so it's boss lady I put it there because it's more like shop I could have just put shop stuff but I don't know, and here I stuck down two of my stickers again so I could jot some like permanent notes here if I wanted to the next section is brain dump now that was actually called ideas before and I decided to put brain dump and did I stick anything on this one? Oh yeah wait let me go back to my pocket here I put girl boss that was part of the sticker collection and then here these are three stickers together slay girl slay and I do like the way these feel just the laminate stuff there's like a bubble right there kind of suck but I didn't want to waste it and I did attempt to <clears throat> my first try went out because I didn't want to waste this I wanted to test it out first but I did test out on foiled cardstock and it worked fine but I had stuck down my stickers first and then laminated and I guess after you've already foiled them if you try to run it through again it just messes up the foiling I don't know if that's usual or not but I decided to not laminate the sticker part so I put that on top after I laminated everything all right so then we have that I moved around some of the photos that I took out from all the pockets that I had I put a sticker a love sticker here so I moved that I'm really not wanting to adhere these these are from the um, the little pocket printers and they're stickers too but I don't know I haven't <laughs> I haven't stuck anything down so this is just ideas that was the brain dump and the next section I left I kept the folder that I said I was going to take out since I took out all the other stuff so I kept that and I put it more in the middle so it doesn't pop out like before here I put gold digger and my sticky notes there's nothing on that one then here I put this one quit slacking and make it happen <laughs> this is the holiday list which I was really bad I was going to do stuff for Easter and send out stuff and I never did and I know I still got time, but I got a lot going on, plus a vacation coming, and I just know I'm not going to get it done. <laughs> um, over here, because I keep this little sticker from Shine Sticker Studio, I put down here Rise and Grind Sunshine and a couple of star, uh, stick hearts. And I had this already there. And then the arrow. Okay, so then what was over here? Just move those things. Oh, so here, this is an acetate. I put the, what is that, geoids, geonoids, I don't know what they're called, but you know what they are. I put that there. And then back here, fight like a girl, and then the really pretty feather that was in that sticker pack. And this is the password section. And then brave. So, and then here are my passwords for shops. And then here's where I added the other initial. It's so shiny. I just love that and I didn't put nothing on the back and over here I put dreamer so I didn't mention I don't think I mentioned it that I had put clear vinyl as pockets which is awesome because you can do this like I can just scoot that down so you can see it on top of the stuff or move it up whatever there it says dreamer so that's what I did and like I said, it's now a little bit skinnier, not as chunky, um, because all the other dividers, they were all pockets, so, and laminated too, you know, out of cardstock, so that made it thicker. 
but yeah so I'm just having fun with my new little planner here and it's pretty much done I might you know add or change out paper clips but I'm kind of keeping it's spring but I'm still keeping like the unicorn theme because I just love that and I guess that is it for today thank you all for watching I will see you guys next time bye now